More pictures of the Bangalore cafe blast suspect have surfaced, showing him travelling on a bus. The explosion, which took place on March 1 at Rameshwaram Cafe in Brookfield in East Bangalore, left at least 10 people injured. One of the pictures also showed the suspect without a hat or a mask. Some reports claim that the suspect's baseball cap has also been recovered by the National Investigation Agency. A source said that it seems that the Bangalore suspect changed his clothes after the blast. Some aspects of the identity of the suspect was revealed through the CCTV trail of March 1 when the bomb blast at the Rameshwaram cafe in the Whitefield area of Bangalore injured 9 people. The CCTV cameras have captured suspect's arrival in a public bus at a bus stop located about 100 kilometers from the cafe at around 10:45 a.m., his entry into the cafe at 11:34 a.m., exit at 11:43 a.m., and subsequent walk to a bus stop over a kilometer away for his escape using public buses. On Wednesday, the NIA announced a reward of rupees 10 lakh for information about the suspect and also posted his CCTV grab. A report in Indian Express quoted its sources as saying that the CCTV trail of the suspect from his arrival to his escape an hour before the 12:56 p.m. blast at the cafe has provided some key leads including his facial features. The publication sources indicated that the suspect travelled in multiple public buses both to plant the IED he was carrying and to flee the scene and made multiple stopovers including at a Muslim religious center a few kilometers from the site of the incident during the getaway process. On March 1, nine people were injured when a blast took place at Bangalore's Rameshwaram Cafe in Brookfield, where both staff and customers at the cafe sustained injuries. The explosion was caused by the bag placed by a customer, according to the Rameshwaram Cafe owners. CCTV video footage of the incident showed an explosion, leading to smoke and panic-stricken customers and others fleeing the place. On March 4, the Ministry of Home Affairs handed over the Bangalore's Rameshwaram Cafe blast probe to the National Investigation Agency. Following the explosion, Karnataka police registered a case under the Stringent Unlawful Activities Prevention Act and Explosives Substances Act as officials from the local unit of NIA and the Intelligence Bureau examined the blast site. Karnataka Chief Minister Siddaramaiah claimed that the explosion is suspected to have been carried out by an improvised explosive device. Meanwhile, the owner will reopen the Brookfield outlet of the Rameshwaram Cafe on 8th March. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.